Muhammad Ada was an Egyptian terrorist hijacker. He was the leader of the September 11th attacks and served as the hijacker pilot of American Airlines Flight 11, which he crashed into the North Tower of the World Trade Center as part of the coordinated attacks. Having turned 33 just 10 days earlier, he was the oldest of the 19 hijackers who took part in the mission. Born and raised in Egypt, Ada studied architecture at Cairo University, graduating in 1990, and continued his studies in Germany at the Hamburg University of with the Al-Quds Mosque, where he met Marwan al-Shehi, Ramzi bin al-Shib and forming the Hamburg cell. Added disappeared from Germany for periods of time, embarking on the hatch in 1995 but also meeting Osama bin Laden and other top al-Qaeda leaders in Afghanistan from late 1999 to early 2000. Ada and the other Hamburg cell members were recruited by bin Laden and college Sheikh Mohammed for a planes operation in the United States. Ada returned to Hamburg in February 2000 and began inquiring about flight training in the United States. In June 2000, Ada Ziad Jara and Marwan al Shahid arrived in the United States to learn how the pilot planes, obtaining instrument ratings in November. Beginning in May 2001, Ada assisted with the arrival of the muscle hijackers and in July he traveled to Spain to meet with Binalship to finalize the plot. In August 2001, Ada traveled as a passenger on several surveillance flights to establish in detail how the attacks could be carried out. On the morning of September 11, 2001, ADA boarded American Airlines Flight 11, which he and his team hijacked 15 minutes after takeoff. Ada took control of the plane and crashed it into the North Tower of the World Trade Center from floors 93 to 99846 AM, causing it to collapse at 1028 that morning after burning for 101 minutes, killing more than 1,600 people, 